your nose? I like your head, by the way. I like your head shoes. Well, thank you very much. Mind me if I say you look kind of old. Uh, it's ironic, but we were born in the same year, right? <laughs> I know, I know. 1896. <laughs> uh, the year for uh, great minds of child minds to be born. <laughs> but uh, you kept your shape pretty good, probably because uh, you died pretty early. <laughs> Practice and one size fits all. 
What about all the children with their different needs, different ideas, different interests? How are you going to manage all those interests and needs with teachers only observing? Uh, young man, I don't think I ever said that uh, you should uh, use the one size fits for all and the approach for every child. And I, I don't think I ever denied that uh, uh, children are social beings. Uh, uh, and, uh, you know, um, I think uh, we have to rethink some things here. But, my missing. But that's not fair. I think that I emphasize a role of the learning independent child also. Somehow I think that uh, I'm more uh, um, uh, appreciating the independent learner, a agentic child, uh, but uh, it looks like we have to become more knowledgeable of each other's theories and uh, not try to read those details. Huh? You are right, Mr. Pierce, you have right. You know, down on earth, uh, the teachers and the researchers, they fight so much about <laughs> me and you and our theories. I, but my name, if I say, the one who are for me, they are winning lately. <laughs>